What's up guys, this is Isaac from Tech2 here. And today we're gonna to be talking about Google's brand new app called Inbox. Now this app was designed for uh, Gmail users. And all you need to do is go into your iOS app store or go into the Google Play Store for Android devices and search Inbox and it should pop up here. Uh, as you can see here, Inbox by Gmail. The inbox that something something <laughs> and here you have some screenshots uh, you can have your uh, emails sorted as you can see here they can be sorted into certain um, from certain people if they're from Gmail addresses or other addresses you can sort them a lot of different ways um, and you can see here you have travel updates stuff like that and then um, you can send them to multiple people. It's very easy. There's a new interface here. Uh, you can see that they changed it up. So everything is much more simple and it's almost uh, futuristic is what a lot of people are saying. Um, now the thing that really stands out with this is you can turn an app into an alarm. So what you can do is actually change uh, an email into an alarm there's like a, a setting I guess and you can set it for in the morning if that email is uh, something that's happening so if you get an email about a reminder for a meeting uh, you can set uh, an alarm 20 minutes before your meeting so you know you have to leave the house and get there and that uh, email will pop up so it just reminds you you don't have to type an extra note if you want to type an extra note you actually can now it's like a to-do list you can actually make uh, reservations like it says here you can just write a little to do for yourself or a little note and it'll pop up uh, so yeah now the one weird thing about this is Google inbox is a little bit different let's open it up here so as you can see it opens up to this screen now what happens is when you click sign in um, it comes up with your previous Gmail options that you had on the other Gmail app or It'll give you new ones if you haven't used one yet. So I'm going to click sign in, but I don't want you guys to see my email. So uh, I'm going to cut this out part this part out real quick. So I'll be right back. All right. So I click sign in for my email. And as you can see, this, uh, this screen pops up right here. It says, looks like you don't have an invite yet. The fastest way to get an invite is from a friend who already has inbox or email inbox at google.com to request one. So what you have to do is either email inbox at google.com and it will put you on a waiting list for invites and uh, every week Google will send out another um, another I guess invite to if you requested it from inbox at google.com it will send one out to you so you'll be able to use inbox if you want it right away you have to find someone who has already been invited and can invite you um, to find somebody who already has a code, all you have to do is either find a friend, someone who can email you one, or there are certain websites. There's a Reddit link, which uh, has a Google inbox invite chain. So uh, they're posting and inviting people there to Google inbox if you want to get it um, early, way before other pe people. So uh, that's what it looks like. Um, and I'm going to talk a little bit more about the articles quick. All right, so here we have an article, which I was going to talk about, from The Verge. Um, and they report uh, media and stuff like that. And they're talking about the new Google inbox, and it feels like the future of email, they say. So if we scroll down here, um, I highlighted a couple of things. Uh, one of the things that stood out to me is they say that Rather than trying to turn your inbox into nothing more than a series of letters and conversations or help you clear your messages out as soon as possible, inbox makes the use of makes use of the fact that your email is full of receipts and notes to self. So what it does is instead of looking at your inbox and seeing that it's emails, it actually turns those into uh, receipts and notes to self. So it's more of a to do list. Um, they also said it combines emails into bundles um, with names like updates and travel. So what uh, Inbox now does is it will combine and sort your emails automatically for you um, into certain things like updates and travel. 
um, based off of keywords, of course, that are in the email. Uh, you can now snooze an email. So if uh, you get an email and you want it to pop up a little bit later, you can actually set a timer or an alarm for it and it'll uh, show up in your inbox later. Uh, so you can have it show up a week later, a day later, whenever you want. And um, this new app is remarkably fast and smooth on all platforms and far better on iOS than the Gmail app. So that means for all phones, um, I'm more of an Apple guy, but Android as well, it is now faster, excuse me, and uh, better and a lot cleaner. So that is uh, kind of an overview um, from The Verge and uh, myself for uh, Google's new inbox app. So thanks for watching, guys. This is Isaac from Tac2 signing out.